Hello and welcome to Let's Play Metal Gear Solid Part 4. Last episode we ripped a tank apart with our teeth and assassinated a member of the KKK and this episode we'll be getting the remote control missile and blowing up the electric floor generator thingy that was put in by someone retarded because they didn't realise people owned rubber boots. Um, I won't be getting the ammo over there behind the steps which is some machine gun ammo and there's some ammo floating over there you can see which is soccer ammo and I don't need that either. Gonna get a call off the colonel telling me I can't use my guns because he's a penis. And there's some guy coming. That's really inconvenient. I shouldn't have left it that long. <coughs> there, to the far left of left bottom, actually, are some grenades, and I will be picking those up. And there are also some chaff grenades underneath the stairs this side as well. But I won't be getting those either because I've got plenty. So I'm just going to head up here. Don't know where that guy is. Hopefully he won't come along anytime soon. Uh, I should stealth rape him, really. Come on. And that was some good sex. Okay. Nope, he's dropped some ammo. I might pick that up. Use the elevator glitch to get up here quickly. Go to basement one. This is the uh, floor where you'll be later fighting Psycho Mantis, but for now we're just going to pick up the remote control missile. Just in this room here, if I can get through the door. Wait for this guy to go past, and then we're going to leave. Oh, we can have a quick look at the guy peeing as well. Because why not? Disgusting. Okay, let's get out of here before we get arrested. Oh, what did you look at that? Came down straight away. Now, <laughs> the next room we're entering is the electrified floor room, but Windows 7 has some real issues with this game and it's crashed about 50 times. I've done some googling and apparently you can't use first person view with the um, remote control missile launcher, which sucks. So I'm going to try and attempt this manually, if that's the right word, I guess aiming without using first person. There's also a cutscene I have to skip or it crashes. Never ever upgrade to Windows 7, it's a pile of crap. Anyway, let's try and do this. So I've got to skip this cutscene before it crashes. Take this call. Oh, it's deep throat, the porn star. Okay. I'm going to head back here, get some air. I always do it. You don't really need to, but uh, it's just a bit of a habit. So now I can't use first person view with the missile because it crashes, so I'm just going to fire it. Oh my god, and try and steer it like this. I have never done the game like this. Oh my god. This really doesn't work. But, uh, not so bad. Please don't shoot the missile down. Ah. Oh, cry. Oh god. Okay. If you leave it too long, it goes into this boost mode, and I really can't afford to use that at the moment, because I can't see where I'm going. That went surprisingly well, and it hasn't crashed, which is, uh... Oh, pleasing. Now, in one of these rooms, you get a gas mask, which you can use to breathe in the gas. It doesn't last forever, but it does extend your um, time of living in the gas quite substantially. So, uh, over here, is it here? That's a ration. And over here, I can't get in there. I think it's possibly in this room, so I'm going to have to use a chaff grenade for this camera. Once we knock that out, I should be able to get the gas mask. Yay! I'm just going to get some more air and then I'll head over to the area with Grey Fox. And I'm not sure how often that'll work either because I've heard bad things about that too. Depending on how bad this gets, I might switch the playthrough to the PlayStation version. And I am now Psycho Mantis. Oh yeah. Snake has some serious breathing problems. <laughs> <coughs> getting uh, getting distracted. Okay, let's put that back on. Oh no, we can't because we need to use the key card. Now we put it back on and run through. If you go around the corner to where all the geek cameras are pointing at, you can get a few items, but I don't think there's anything new down there, so I'm just going to knock out this camera and run straight through. Because that's the easiest thing for me to do at the moment. I don't want it to crash. Wow, 
Wonderful! Now, <laughs> I might watch this cutscene. It depends. Please, Windows 7, don't let me down again. I can't take another take of this. In my opinion, Grey Fox is the, well, the most badass character in any video game. Corpses! We get the idea. If you're a necrophiliac, you're going to be in your element at the moment. Fantastic! He's, uh... He seems to have collapsed on some ketchup. Hmm. Somebody sounds happy. That is... <laughs> ah! Okay, maybe the stealth effect is a little bit messed up on the PC version with Windows 7. He sort of just looks like he's covered in a grey mat. Right, so we're going to follow... Uh, Grey Fox into this room and fight him. What you can do with Grey Fox is use the infrared goggles to find him when he goes invisible, although it's not that hard to spot him when he looks like a mattress at the moment. And uh, chaff grenades also make him spaz out so it's easier to punch him, which may be useful for me, except I just wasted the last one. Okay, this will be interesting. He pissed himself. Fantastic. Now, make me feel it. Make, make me, me feel, feel alive, alive again. again. I think I need to find a life. No, I'm not hit. Okay, so how do I punch shift? Oh, oh, ew. You're gonna hear that a lot, so uh, get used to it. So some guy with a sword somehow manages to lose to a guy with fists. Right. Give me a revolver and then, um, you know, you can use your fists and we'll see how that goes. No, oh, I couldn't reach him for the last punch. So basically you just uh, let him do his little combo there and then punch him when he's done. Oh, you missed. Apparently exoskeletons count for shit when someone's punching you. No, please. Ah, famous bullets. They're a bit useless in this fight, so I don't know where they stop you up. You can, like I said, use your chaff grenades and um, make him spaz out and then shoot him, but I just used my last one, so... Ironic that earlier I said I didn't need to pick any more up. That uh, flipping is quite impressive, but when you stop still and let someone hit you, the effect sort of wears off, I'm sorry. Oh, it's time to find the floating mattress. That's a fun game. Where's the floating mattress today? Oh, that's stealth. I don't know how I'm going to find him. I'm sorry, that, that was difficult. <sighs> okay, you guys, keep your eyes peeled for the mattress. Hmm. Oh, look. Something sort of sur suspicious behind these supercomputers. Don't break the computer just wrong. Oh, no. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is ridiculous. Ooh. Ooh. I think that's a Sega Saturn. Or a PlayStation. Oh, that is the most horrific render. Anyway, I'm wasting time. Don't have much time left. Where is the floating mattress? Yay, chaff grenades. Floating mattress. Hello. Oh, Christ. Nifty. I'm here, Snake. Uh, that's great, except this game doesn't have stereo. So when you say I'm here, I have no idea where you are. Like old times. I've been waiting for this place. Serious masochist. I think there are clubs for that, you know, where you can sort of hang out with other people who enjoy pain. Don't really bother harassing me with your sick fetishes, though. Hurt you more. Uh, don't think I will. Just shut up and let me beat the crap out of you. I don't know how much time left on the video. Oh, 
paper floating and then disappearing. That's a good magic trick. Do you remember Snake? Yes. The feel of battle. The clashing of bones and sinew. I can kick him up the arse. Oh no! Okay, that was a dumb move. <laughs> yeah. There we go, and now when he starts spazzing out at the end, all you have to do is shoot him. Ow. Electricity is painful. Hello? That's it. Okay. So, yeah, as you might have guessed, that was Grey Fox, one of his old allies, blah, 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 blah. We're going to get past these scenes so I can stop the movie because I don't have much time left. <laughs> Metal Gear's Another error. These are some of the... I used to think... Yes. That's Articon, basically. Rex is in the he aids you through your mission, but he's a bit I'll of a pussy. Meryl. Meryl. Yeah. Something's wrong. Uh, a disguise. If she, Japan, you're. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Sorry, this has been a bit boring. I'm kind of tired and frustrated with having to do this. Uh, you know, roughly about ten times just to, uh, just to make it work without crashing. Oh, there's one of uh, Kojima's other works. Anyway, catch you next time, and uh, thanks for watching.